Dear students, welcome to Sethi Botany classes. In this video, we will study about maize plant. Its botanical name is Yab Maize. Common name is Makki. This belongs to family Cramini, also called as Poaceae. This is an erect plant. Height of the plant is 1 to 5 meter. This is annual plant. Complete its life cycle in one season. This is attached to soil by means of root system. This root system is fibrous, adventitious root system. This plant also has still root which arise from its lower root and these roots they provide support to the erect stem of the plant. Now stem is divided into nodes and internodes. Now this is node, this is node and this is the internode part. And internode is covered by sheathing leaf phase. So this is the part of the leaf which is covering the internode. So this is called as, this part is called as sheathing leaf phase. And this is called as leaf plate or lamina of the leaf. At the junction of leaf phase and leaf plate is present a membranous outgrowth. This is called as ligule. And at this part they are broadened. This part is broadened part of the leaf plate. So this part is also called as auricle. Now stem of the maize plant is solid. This is not hollow from inside. Now this plant is monoecious. This bears both the flowers, male flowers and female flowers. But they are born at different places. So this condition is also called as diclinus. Now this is its female flower. This is arising in, again in the axil of the leaf. Each female flower is a modified branch. We can see this part of the female part. Uh, this is called as cob or spadex. And this part is having nodes and internodes, which are contracted internodes. And from each, in, each node leaves they are arising. And these leaves, they are covering this cob or spadix part of the uh, maize plant. So this is the female part, which is called as cob or spadix. And these are brackets or standing leaves, which are covering this. And this part is the silk part, which is coming out of it. Now we can see this part. When we have opened this cob or spadix, now it has pistillate flowers. Now these pistillate flowers, now they have ripened to form the grains. So this is single seeded grains present in the rows on the cob or the spadix. So these are the pistillate flowers. And this silk which I have earlier shown you, this is actually style and stigma of the female flower which is coming out of the cob or the spadix like this. Now this is the female flower. Now this is male flower which is born at the tip of the plant. Now this male flower, male flowers are present in the form of spikelets. So this whole inflorescence is called as tessel. Now these are the male flowers now which are bearing stamens. Now these are its spikelets which are having stamen. So stamens they will produce the pollen grains. Now they are pollinated with the help of wind, also called as anemophily. So pollen grain will reach toward the female flower. Fertilization will take place. This will lead to the formation of the cob or the spadex, which is having mature grains or cryopsis. So this is about morphology of the maize plant. If you like my video, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.